The Mandela Effect, a freaky phenomenon causing the collective misremembering of a fact or event. Tens of thousands of people, or in some cases more, all claim to have a memory of something that never actually occurred. What could cause such a phenomena? Have we crossed into an alternate reality? Nobody knows, but the following examples are some of the most famous going on right now. Here are the 10 freakiest examples of the Mandela Effect, part two. Number 10 is Sex in the City. The Mandela Effect can bring about a subtle shift in our reality, a change which is so small that most don't even consider it. But when one of the most popular TV shows changes its title as if by magic, a lot of fans are going to take notice. That's exactly what happened with the show Sex in the City. The romantic comedy drama series was a big hit when it aired from 1998 until 2004. But soon after, fans started noticing a problem with Sex in the City. That being the title has always been Sex and the City. You would think for a show which has such a fervent following that its fans would at least get the name right. And so debate has raged for many years over the name of the show and why so many fans remember the title being different. Number 9 is C-3PO. C-3PO, the shiny gold robot from Star Wars, has been in almost every entry of the movie series since the beginning. Since the first toys came out after the original 1977 film was released, people have been obsessively collecting action figures, statues, and even artwork of C-3PO, as well as other characters in the franchise. So you would think that we would all notice if there's something off about Luke Skywalker's robotic friend. Nearly everyone remembers C-3PO as being gold, but the truth is he isn't. That is, at least not all of him. The truth is, his entire left leg has always been silver. The only time that it was changed was during The Force Awakens when it was changed for technical reasons. Even Anthony Daniels himself, who played C-3PO, is puzzled by the number of people who even worked on the series who are continuously shocked to learn that he always had a silver leg. Egg. How do you remember C-3PO? Do you remember him always being entirely gold? Or do you remember at all the silver leg? Number 8 is the human skull. Think of all those classic depictions of the human skull throughout the years. Even during Halloween, for example, you'll see creepy skeletons with grinning faces and black, empty eye sockets staring at you. But recently, a number of people following the Mandela Effect have suggested that there's been another reality shift as it pertains to those very skulls. You see, while we might remember the human skull having dark, empty eye sockets, the truth is the socket is actually covered in bone. This has caused great debate in the Mandela Effect community about whether this was always the case. Some have even looked for residual clues that the eye sockets were once empty and have found the evidence in artwork where snakes are crawling out of the eye sockets as if there was no bone there at all. Number 7 is Charles Augustus Lindbergh Jr. In March of 1932, one of the most famous kidnappings of all time took place, many believing that the outcome of that tragic event has been directly altered through the Mandela Effect. The 20-month-year-old son of famous aviator Charles Lindbergh was taken from their home in New Jersey. There was a mass outcry about the kidnapping, with flyers and media campaigns asking the public for any information. But tragically, the young boy Charles Lindbergh Jr. was found to have been murdered by his kidnapper. While there was great debate about whether the kidnapper Richard Hauptmann was actually guilty, there's an even greater controversy surrounding the case. Thousands of people swear that they are certain the baby was never found and that the kidnapper was never caught. How could it be that such a famous case that went down in the history books could be misinterpreted by so many people? Number 6 is Pikachu's Tale. 
One of the most famous examples of the Mandela Effect involves the popular card game and animated cartoon Pokemon. The most popular Pokemon character is, arguably, Pikachu, an electric-type Pokemon who was introduced in the original first-generation iteration of the card game. Pikachu is famous for his bright, rabbit-like design, including being bright yellow all over. But many people believe that this was not always the case. The Mandela Effect seems to have altered the appearance of this iconic character. Many believe that Pikachu originally had a yellow tail with a black tip. Fans of the card game and cartoon especially hold this view. No one can explain what happened, and so the changing appearance of Pikachu remains a mystery to all. Think about Pikachu for a moment. How do you remember him? Did he always have a black tip tail, or was he always yellow as he currently is in reality? Number five is the thinker. August Rodin's statue, The Thinker, shows a man in deep contemplation. First presented to the public in 1904, the bronze statue is one of the most famous of its kind. The depiction of a man sitting on a rock in deep thought became so renowned that it even entered popular culture, with people imitating the pose of the statue leaning over, resting its forehead on its fist thinking. But there's just one problem that's not the pose of the thinker. In the now existing statue, the thinker rests its chin on its hand. This has caused widespread controversy as millions of people around the world are certain that the original the thinker always rested its forehead on its fist. This bizarre change is so drastic that when many people look at the statue, it just doesn't look right, creating a sense of unease in the viewer as though though reality itself has been warped. Number four is Henry VIII. Henry VIII was King of England from 1509 until 1547 when he died. Much has been written about this king, who was well known for having six marriages and separating the English church from Catholicism just so that he could justify his lifestyle. But Henry was also known for being a stout man with a large appetite, and this image was captured perfectly in the famous portrait by Hans Holbein. In the portrait, King Henry VIII stands proudly, a figure full of life holding in one hand a large turkey leg which represents his affluence and earthly appetite. Or, at least, that's how most people remember the painting. In fact, there is no turkey leg, and instead he's standing holding a purse, which we can assume contains gold. In another example of the Mandela Effect, it seems that the original picture has vanished from history. Number three is 50 States. If you live in the United States, you've probably been taught that there are 50 states in the Union. But many people claim that they were taught that there are more states than that in the US. No one is quite sure where this strange phenomenon comes from, but a simple Google search shows that this isn't a small group. It's a large number of people across the globe who believe this. What's freaky about this Mandela effect is that those who think that there are more states tend to agree with each other that there are 52 states. Now, some assert that this misunderstanding comes from believing that the U.S. territories such as Puerto Rico are actually states when they're not. But despite this, there are a growing number of people who believe that reality has somehow shifted and the consequence is that the U.S. has fewer states than it used to. Number two is the assassination of Martin Luther King Jr. Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated for preaching that all races should learn to live together and love each other. It's a lesson that we need more than ever today, and it's that reason that Martin Luther King Jr. continues to be a hero for so many across the world. But despite being so well known, the details of King's assassination have been attributed to the Mandela Effect. Many people swear that when he was killed, the murder weapon was a handgun. Some even remember the killer having a different name. Others remember King being assassinated with a grenade or a bomb. The accounts vary so widely that the Mandela Effect conspiracy theorists argue that his death was what's known as a pivot point in history. That's when an event has changed so many times that our timeline has settled into what it is now. And number one is Jaws. 
One of the most mind-blowing examples of the Mandela Effect is a scene from the James Bond film including the henchman Jaws. In the 1979 Bond film Moonraker, Jaws is known for having teeth made out of metal. In his most famous scene, he meets a girl and falls in love. As Jaws smiles, showing his metal teeth, the audience thinks that the girl won't like his appearance. Then she smiles, showing that she has metal braces and so they have that connection. This is exactly exactly how people remember this scene. But in a bizarre example of the Mandela effect, when we now watch that scene back, the girl smiles and has no braces. Not only has that scene changed, but the entire purpose of it has been removed. In fact, that scene now makes no sense at all and seems to have been altered for some unknown reason. How do you remember that scene? Did the girl have braces or do you remember her as it is now? So all of these cases of the Mandela Effect beg the question, how do you remember them? Are they exactly as they are today or do you remember them as something else? Only you can answer that.